Hey there, y'all. It's Melanie Ferguson with Southern Crush at Home, where I hope to inspire you all to create and decorate a home that you love. Listen, it is a Saturday afternoon, and I am so excited to be coming on here with you guys with a fun, easy, quick DIY project. So a lot of you guys have been getting cleaned out and organized since Christmas is behind us, and you are just wanting to declutter and get everything um, kind of put where it's going to be for the year. I have not, I'll be honest, I have not gotten started with that yet. So is it'll, it'll, it'll eventually catch up. I'll, I'll get on it. But, um, right now I still have all four trees up. I have all four trees up, but that's not going to stop me from doing some DIYs with you guys. Cause this is going to be fun. So you guys, I put that here. Um, let's see, what did I want to tell you? Uh, this is really just something that uh, one of them I thought up myself and one of them I saw online. So we'll just run with it. As you hop on, say, hey, listen, let me know what you're doing this weekend and tell me if you have taken down your tree yet or if your tree is still up like me. Four trees are up. Four trees are up. We've been a little bit busy. If you've been watching my uh, videos, you know that we've been out of town. We've been doing all sorts of things. So we're not back to normal yet. We're not even close to back to normal yet. Hey, Michelle and Norma and Karen and Wendy, how are you? So we're going to use a couple pot holders. You guys know how much pot holders are my friends. If you've been following me a minute, you know that pot holders are my friend. So these are from Dollar Tree. They're just, they come in a pair. So there's that two for one dollar. So <laughs> if even I can do that math. That means they were 50 cents each. So that's super awesome. Nancy, your trees are still up. Good to hear. I am not alone. So I'm just separating these, taking the little tags out and kind of get them, getting them ready. So Dollar Tree pot holders, just your plain vanilla Dollar Tree pot holders. I went ahead and tore the tag off this one. I'm going to tear it off this one while we chat. Um, this this uh, project, y'all, it literally takes like a hot second, not even a minute, a hot second. So um, I'm just trying to, you know, visit. I know a lot of um, newer viewers that pop on, the, the bigger the video gets, the more sprinkling we do, the more people hop on and we get new people. And sometimes the new people are like, ah, we just want to see the tutorial. But that is what YouTube is for. This is social media. So we're going to visit and chat. I like to hear about what you guys are up to. So if you are following along on the decluttering challenge, let me know that too. It's southerncrushathome.com slash declutter. And that is the calendar that we're trying to follow. Now it doesn't have to be perfect y'all. And literally if you just want to pick like your top 10 things on there um, out of the 31, then you might be in the same boat with me. All right, first project we're going to do, just grab one of them. We're going to, this one happens to be a pot holder where the um, loop, the hoop is in the middle. I love seeing that. Oh my goodness, y'all. We, um, I didn't know. Sorry, my son called. Um, he'll probably call again. I didn't know um, if anyone would be on in the middle of a Saturday, but it looks like we have lots of people on. <laughs> Um, yes, my phone got called. Okay, you just put your Valentine's tree together, together, Melanie. That's super awesome, and I love your name. All right, so we're going to take it. A lot of times the hoop is up on the corner, which is extra helpful with this project, but we're literally going to make a uh, pouch for my fabric scissors. A pouch for my fabric scissors, y'all. I'm so stinking excited about this project. I don't know why, but if your um, hoop happens to be on the corner bonus points for that this one happens to be in the middle which is fine for me because I don't really mind so you're just going to pinch it together and roll it I'm going to put it you can do it as like you can either do it like I was showing you just kind of halfway or you can literally take it and seal up the bottom which is more of what I'm going to do so I'm just kind of playing with it getting it how I wanted how I want, but I am still going to leave a little bit of a hole at the bottom so that it can, um, they can peek out. Okay. So really the main, just, they're going to hang in here. 
this can still hang it. They'll just hang at an angle. Um, or, or an idea is to put a little magnet back here. They have lots of magnets you can glue on here and you can magnet it up. And I probably still will do that, y'all. I just didn't bring it over here with me. Um, magnet it up to uh, your workspace, your fridge, your workspace, your memo board, wherever. And you have an awesome um, place to hold your coveted fabric scissors <laughs> so that nobody takes them and they know that this is your pouch. All right, so I'm literally gonna take some hot glue I'm gonna get this out of our view here. Some hot glue and just glue this puppy down. And I'm probably just gonna do it in one little spot for now. I say that, I'm probably not. Hold on, y'all. This isn't, there we go. It hadn't taken. It hadn't gotten all the way to the edge. And a good glue stick to put in here for this project would be more of a fabric glue. Um, that would do really, really well in here. It doesn't have to be super strong, y'all, because we're not, you know, these scissors aren't super heavy, but, um, you know, just enough to keep it closed and keep the weight in there so that it doesn't go anywhere. I'm just holding it together for just a second. Um, yes, Char, I have to hide them from myself as well because I use them on everything but at least this will help remind me that they are special. They have their own little pouch, okay? What I'm gonna add to this, guys, this is the fun part. This is the crafty part. You can take these little pouches, whatever you decide you're gonna use them for. I'm gonna put, you know, happen to use them for my fabric scissors, but you can decorate this little part however you want. So I've seen some really cute sayings that people put on a little card or a sticker here, um, you know, about their scissors. If you, um, oh, I don't remember. I don't remember, but I'll post them here. If you guys know some cute sayings for scissors and um, borrowing them and putting them back in the sack or whatever it is, then um, post it below. But I'm going to decorate it with, guess what? Guess what I'm going to decorate it with? I'll give you five guesses. <laughs> what do you think? I know you guys will know. I know you guys will know. I'm going to decorate. Yes, Tanya. Tanya, you got it. Bling. I'm going to totally use a little piece of bling with this. What do you think? This is the one I picked. It's um, the lights over there. Can't find it. Um, it is a little daisy or something and I don't even know how to get it open I may have to use my scissors and I don't want to um, let's see here come on little pouch I can see where it wants me to open it but it, there we go all right it's just so tiny there we go I got it all right so I'm gonna take this little piece and I'm gonna decorate the um, pouch here. You guys are going to love it. You guys are going to love it. Um, yes, back away slowly for fabric only. I love that one. That is so super cute. Okay, just using a little dot for this because honestly, it's not going to take a lot. And I picked gold because my scissors were gold handled, but you can pick whatever like I said, decor, decorations, embellishments that you want. Okay, so what do you think? Super cute. Super cute. This is really simple. I like my things simple. You may choose to do tons of decorations on the front of here. They have little sticker flowers. They have um, ribbon you can put on the trim. I even brought over, just for suggestions, the bling ribbon. Some some of you guys like the bling ribbon that I have. It 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 is from Dollar Tree, and you could literally um, take some of it and trim the edges of the pot holder with the bling and make it super fun. But yeah, this is um, one of the two little DIY easy projects that I wanted to share with you this afternoon. So this is one and it's just for the scissors. 